I hope that's gonna be good enough to sink. Whatever. Hey guys, this is Game of Cow. We're playing Mario Golf Total Tour Ring Attack once again. Still with Diddy, it's the same general recording thing. And yeah, Waterfall Arc is the first thing we've gotta do. So, how do we want to hit this? Ideally, I want to be hitting like just under the tree. So, I think I'm going to try and hit this shot. But yeah, Ring Attack is not. Oh god, that's over hit. Ring attack, not the easiest of modes, that's going to hit the tree, which is not quite what I wanted to do, but you know, that works. Hitting the tree is not a disaster there, because I can still make this shot. Is that going through the ring? Yes, it is easily going through the ring. I can make this. This is definitely a shot which is doable. It might not be the best shot in the world, but it is definitely there. Yeah, I'm going to plant myself straight in the bunker. That is kind of like... Never mind, not a disaster because I can do a pretty routine approach, which I've undershot, but that's why I top spun it. And yeah, oh, oh, <laughs> oh, wow, I would have been slightly more annoyed if this wasn't in ring attack, but yeah, not quite. Just too much momentum on that. Hey, good start though. Complete. So, yeah, we have the first of six down, and we're only really a minute in, that's pretty good. Well, a minute and a half. Who's counting, really? Nobody cares. Skid, ski, skip. Um, it's pretty cool, because you've got to hit the ring over here. It does sort of force you into the rough, though, because there's not very much chance of getting this if you're not in the rough. So, whatever. That's your, it's okay though, because this is a par 4, so even if I miss this next shot, if so long as I get the ring, it's not really bad. That is going through the ring, but I'm just going to make absolute sure by hitting the bottom of the, you know, hitting the bottom trajectory, hitting the top of the ball, and yeah, that is the shot I am going to do. That has gone through the ring, of course, and landed on the green. Oh, go on, go on, go on. Ho <laughs> ho ho! 1.4 feet away, that is an excellent shot from there, as the game said itself. Fantastic shot. If I can keep swinging like that all the way through this game mode, I would be very happy. Anyway, donuts, no, puns, it's... Well, they have some pretty funny titles here. So you can see the one ring is right there. So, it's... You've got to hit onto that little island with the tree there. It's probably not a bad idea, idea to actually try and aim for that tree. But I'm going to probably hit an iron shot uh, onto that island, so yeah. Obviously I could go for the green if I was doing this normally, but I'm not, so I can't. Uh, five iron, yeah, let's just aim straight for the tree. I should be able to get myself away from that next, uh, next shot, I hope. That's my biggest worry at the moment, is that I might not be able to get away from that tree now, but hey, we've managed to get the ring. I didn't even get towards the tree in the first place, but it's not landing in the water. The camera angle kind of gave that away, and I can make a nice approach for birdie. This is a par 5, so it's not terrible. Why did I top spin that? It's at plus 4%. That's going miles away, but whatever. Yeah, that was pretty bad, but hey, that is what happens sometimes. We've got a relatively a very tricky putt to do now, but it looks like I might have got it right. I have indeed, so we got a birdie on that one too. That is pretty darn awesome. So, uh, with these ones being shortish at the moment, I might do two or even three of these in the day, it depends. But, hey, let's not go too far yet, because this one is not the easiest of things to do. Um, where am I going to aim this? Obviously I could hit through the first couple if I really wanted, but, uh, I don't know, I think I could get away with that if I super backspin this and it might go far enough uh, through the button, you know, back in the bunker. So we're gonna try that. I think it should super backspin enough going back through that bunker that I'll be able to cleanly hit the next shot, so I'll be able to get out of the bunker. Yep, out of the bunker I can hit through the ring and that is going to be a good shot. Not even gonna bother lining that up any further. Minus 5% really sucks, but what can you do? Should leave me a reasonable enough putt. 
and it's a birdie chance anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, if you guys think this is too easy at the moment, I told you, the first couple are not that, uh, not that hard, but they get much harder as they go along, so... By the time we get to Blooper Bay, you're going to probably be seeing some rage at that because, yeah. Well, maybe not seeing rage, I don't know, but you're definitely not going to be seeing them done all first time, etc. Anyway, this is, of course, a par 3, and we are having to hit through this thing over here. Um, not really got too much of a massive strategy for this one, I just hit the shot like that, and I'm just going to deal with the consequences of the next one. It's obviously gone through the ring, it's probably going to land in the bunker. No, it's going to land in the rough, that's actually better, because although it's further away, it's a cleaner shot. So, I'm happier to be in the rough this time. And, yeah, nice clean hit, minus 2%, not going to matter that much, and hey, that was pretty good. So, decent chip, obviously going for the par, we are going to complete this one, it's going to be very nice. And that is, I think, five of them done in six minutes, so that's pretty good. Yeah, one more left to do. Flowering Arches, this one is like the tricky one for this thing, because this is not an easy shot. Um, my idea, I think, what I want to do is I would want to try and hit both of them at once, but it's not going to happen. This is just too difficult to do. So, uh, what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and get this one, and then just uh, hit the tree for the next shot and get par. That's my idea. So, let's see if this works. Please don't hit the water, that would be pretty bad. Uh, if you're hearing stuff outside, that's kind of obvious. Yep, there we go, we've hit that one. I can now... Maybe I don't even need to hit the tree, maybe I can get this around. Um, I'm going to take the risk and I'm going to see if I can get, if that's going to count. I think it will. Yes it does, excellent. So we've managed to get the perfect first shot on this one so that we can land. Oh go on, go on. Oh ho, 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 what a shot that was. Haha. <laughs> okay, so that was very good. Definitely happy with that. And yeah, Diddy is proving his worth on this set. So... That is set 2, and I think because we've now done 12, we should... Uh, no, we're not. We have to do 4 on each set. So yeah, this is what we've got to deal with next time. So, this has been Game of Cow playing uh, this game again, Mario Golf Tolstoy Tours Ring Attack, and join me next time when we go into Shifting Sands and see how this one fares. It's obviously going to be harder, and yeah, some of these are not that easy, so... Yeah, they're good fun on occasions, but some of them are just infuriating. Hopefully, we won't have to see that. But anyway, take care, guys.